Welcome guys, and today I'll be starting a talk through for Donkey Kong Country. However, this is not a talk through I chose. Rather, I gave the runner-up in the random draw for the DVD, charity DVD uh, the option of six games to choose from, and Tor4G chose Donkey Kong Country. So here you go, Tor. Enjoy. Oh, Donkey Kong Country. Oh, I spent so much time trying to speedrun this game. Best I ever did was 57 minutes to do uh, all the bonuses. Poor DK. He's just getting up in the morning. He's like, where's my, my banana horde? And it's gone. And where's Diddy? The little Teddy's supposed to be guarding it. And all that fun garbage. Well, you know what? Haha, <laughs> take that, you stupid naughty. But let's go back up here. DK's like, I forgot something important back at home. And it's it's my one-up balloon. Because you can't go on a trip through the jungle without a one-up balloon. But enough goofing around with the secondary character. We're going to use the properly good character, which is Diddy. Diddy is the freaking man, or in this case, monkey. Because he jumps really well, unlike, unlike uh, Mr. Uh, Donkey Kong here. He can do kick-ass stuff. So, take care of him. This is an animal buddy called Rambi. You can ride Rambi, destroy stuff. And those letters I'm picking up, they can get you one-ups if you uh, spell Kong. But I already missed the K, and I'm not going back for it. One thing you'll notice about me is that I'm very ambivalent about picking up uh, stuff. I'm going to find all the bonus rooms, but I'm not promising I'm going to try particularly hard. <laughs> You're going to see that a lot. I really don't care. I don't try for to win the bonus rooms. You may, you may think that's kind of kind of silly, but I just don't enjoy them in this game, so I don't try to do them. I mean, if they're easy to do or something, sure. All right, that was the first level. Very hard, I know. Now, this is the first level in the game where they, they try to make it all fancy. In this case, they make it rain. Now, that was an army. Armies, Diddy can only kill them in two hits, whether he rolls into them or jumps on them. Um, DK, however, has the option of, uh, of actually taking them out with a jump on the head. Here, let's see if I can demo that for you. There you go. But I don't like D D DK, pardon me. Oops. Oh, found a bonus. That was tricky of me. Bananas. Oh, I didn't make anything. Now, I could just let, you know, physics take its course and unleash a tire from the ground there. But I have no desire to collect the, the icons at all. I'm not going to be doing the bonus rooms during the run. The animal bonus rooms. I'll uh, do them later on. Like, there's a code. Now, you may see at the bottom of the screen there... Right wherever he's looking, there's a barrel there. Hard to see, though, in the driving rain. Now, it's a game. Who can track the balloon and find it? Where is it? Over here? No, over there. I actually have my eyes closed, so I'm surprised I even hit a barrel. <laughs> oh, yes. My lack of caring about those bonus rooms is probably going to get on people's nerves by the end of this. But that's just the way I roll. Now, let's go see old Cranky here. Cranky is the original Donkey Kong. And he doesn't think much of you, needless to say. A leap of... Why are you beating me, you jerk? Ooh, thanks for that hot tip, because we never would find her. Yeah, Cranky doesn't tell you a whole lot of useful information. He thinks he's smart, but he's not. He's an idiot, quite frankly. But what can you do when you live in the jungle? Throw a barrel, follow down, grab a K, go in there. Quickly go to the right, or otherwise you'll miss that balloon, because it's floating away somehow, despite being in a cave. Don't ask me, I just work here. Oh, hard, that's a hard bonus to find right there. This bonus I'll do, you just jump into a barrel, it shoots you through everything, you get bananas. Thank goodness. Whee! Hey, I'm still alive. How'd that happen? Oh, well. Haha, <laughs> I'm not sure how I hit that guy with that, but, uh, okay. We'll take it. Uh-oh, we might accidentally spell Kong. We gotta be careful. You see a couple of barrels like that? It means that I'm gonna throw it and it's not gonna bust that wall open for some reason. It's best just to walk the barrels up. The hit detection can be a little wonky. Look at this, I'm getting bananas! But I don't want bananas. Bananas are for chumps. Chumps and monkeys. Oh, there's an on-guard token. You can just bounce up and get it if you want. I don't want to, so I'm not going to. 
All right. Here's something in the game. You have certain spots on the ground. If DK slams them with his fist by holding down and pressing Y, you'll make bananas and other bonuses pop out. You can even find uh, you can even find uh, balloons doing that. And if you time it correctly and hit an enemy, you'll earn a banana while you kill him. It is one thing that DK has over Diddy. And that's about the only useful thing. Well, I guess he can kill crushes, but, you know, we'll, we'll get to that. This is the only game where they're truly, truly different. Well, truly different and both useful to a degree. Because the other two... It, it, you'll, if I do all three, you'll see. I don't know. I may. I may not. This is the first swimming level. This game definitely has... It, I remember how beautiful and awesome this game was when it first came out. And everyone was just so awestruck by it. Where is he, anyway? Oh, there he is. But you look at it compared to its sequels, and it looks like crap. <laughs> it's almost like Rare was like, wow, we can do a lot of cool stuff. Oh, yes, and you get that and come back around. This is on guard. On guard can stab with his nose and kill most monsters under the sea. Under the sea. There'll be no accusations, just tasty crustaceans under the sea. Yes, I know, I know. It's friendly crustaceans, but he eats them anyway, so I'm going to sing my version and be completely and utterly wrong. Hey, Chomps Jr., how's it going? You dead. Oh, look at your father, Chomps. Eat it. And this wall's secret, and it goes up to an espresso icon. But I don't want that. That's for goofs. Goofs and terrorists. you got to decide which one you are when you pick it up. Ooh, an N. I might spell Kong two levels in a row. Dear God, what's wrong with me? Oh, bite size. You are ridiculous. Oh, double shot for bite size. Hey, that's a clambo. And much like Nintendo Power once told me, don't Rambo the clambo, because that'll end up with you in pain. And nobody wants that. That would be terrible. All right, let's go up next to see Funky. Hey, Funky. Yeah, rocking out. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, we can't fly anywhere right now, so we just kind of wasted our time. So let's just fly our way back over here. It allows you to go to previous worlds that you've already been to if you want to, say, stock up on lives or look for bonus rooms you missed. That's just how things roll. So let's go up here. I'm feeling lazy. We're going to take the shortcut. Shortcut, 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 shortcut. Jeez, I'm very hyper today. Oh, shortcuts. What do we got now? Hey, you. What's up here? Oh, it's a Rambi, which we don't want that. Oh, we got to go through some barrel blasting. The reason I didn't keep going on the shortcut path is there's a bonus around here to grab, and you can't get it if you take the shortcuts. Now, when you get into that one, don't sh you don't shoot until that's out of the way, because that unveils a bonus round. Now, if you miss that jump, you look like a complete tool. But also, if those ones are the ones that just start moving up and down, if you just rapidly tap a button to shoot your uh, Kong through there... Oh, that was dumb. Oh, that was neat. Not sure how that happened. But anyway, if that's not the bonus room, is it? Is there a bonus room here? God, I'm clueless. Clueless, I say. Whoops. That was not what I intended. Yeah, there's a bonus room back there, but ask if I know if I jump down a cliff. <laughs> wow, this is just getting off the rails, isn't it? Okay, let's try this again, shall we? There's the freaking bonus room. Goodness gracious. And if you're careful, you can get two out of three there, but again, me and bonus rooms don't go together. So what was I trying to say before I completely got off the rails? I don't know. There's a shortcut up there I could go after, but I'm not going after that shortcut. I'll do this the proper way. What the hell? I'm feeling crazy. Let's do this the proper way. Proper, proper, proper. Got two blast two barrels. It basically is once they're exactly lined up, but there should be a little bit of differential, depending on how fast they're moving and all that fun stuff. And occasionally there's ones if you miss, they will uh, give you another chance. There we go. See, not that hard. I don't have time for your hijinks. So, just go back to this level. You see the name there, Barrel Canning Canyon? See there's an exclamation mark? That means that you've collected all the bonuses, or been in all the bonus rooms. You don't have to actually collect anything. When this is Candy Kong, 
And the guys get all in love with her, and she blows them kisses, and they're like, ooh, yeah, thanks. And then they jump in the barrel, and you can save your game. So, you know, 14% of the game covered already. I wonder, should we take on this boss right now? He's scary. Oh, let's try it. I don't know if I have enough time. It's gonna be tough. This is very naughty. After you hit him, he has to jump one length, and then you can bounce on him again. As you can see, this is pathetic. And once he's down, you get back a huge-ass banana. And that's Diddy's celebration. If you want to see DK's celebration, it's going to require me to screw up first, and that's just not happening. But join us next time. We'll head into the monkey mines and see what we can find. See you then.